Mother of three, Sarah Ellis, will never forget her darkest days battling depression. I was at several points where this is it, I can't, I can't do this anymore. She tried antidepressants, more than a dozen of them, attempting to stay on each for the six-week trial doctors recommend, but the side effects were debilitating. So I was very sluggish, very fatigued, my sleep was disordered. Like so many battling depression, years passed trying drug after drug. That particular drug. Until Dr. Matthew Stanley recommended a genetic test to see why her body wasn't responding. It can tell me if you're going to have difficulty with metabolizing a drug I might prescribe. Avera Institute for Human Genetics in Sioux Falls, South Dakota is among those at the cutting edge of pharmacogenomics, looking at how our genetics influence the way we process medications. We'll hone in and look at the medications. Maybe it's down to four to six that are more effective for you. The test yeah, costs $179 and is often okay. covered by insurance. One antidepressant. One Sarah antidepressant. found her genetics made her overly sensitive to many of the newer medications. So Dr. Stanley prescribed an older class of antidepressants and experimented with lower doses. It gave me hope. It gave me the will to keep fighting. In depression patients, that can be life-saving. Finally, Sarah found the right combination and is now the mom she wants to be. Come on, buddy. Thanks to a new field of medicine with a very personal touch. Kristen Dahlgren, NBC News, Sioux Falls, South Dakota. Hey, NBC News fans, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.